Peeling back the curtain on the mysteries of the final frontier, space. NASA Langley's Research Center is welcoming the public this Saturday for an open house. It is an opportunity to learn what's being done here at Hampton Roads to take us to the moon and one day to Mars. Chief Meteorologist Jeff Edmondson gives us an inside look at what that open house will entail. This Saturday at NASA's Langley Research Center in Hampton, you can go inside the gates. They're letting us in. It's an open house. We can see 16 different facilities. We're not going to talk about that right now. Let's go. Our first stop is the National Transonic Facility, one of only two places in the world that has this type of wind tunnel. The one thing about this wind tunnel is that the pressure can drop really, really low or increase really, really high. So we can test these small scale models accurately inside of the tunnel. Another stop you should make is a visit to the Structures and Materials Lab. Here in the laboratory, they're working on structures that we can use for our future moon missions. And one of them is the tall lunar tower. If you need to generate electricity on the moon, especially at the South Pole on the moon, where we're going to be sending our astronauts, you need to build a very large tower so you can capture that sunlight when it's nighttime on the moon. On the moon, nighttime can last 14 days. So the goal is to build a giant tower to generate electricity to capture that sunlight. Then a few feet away, step inside the inflatable habitat. So this is what it would be like, this is really cool, if you were living on the moon or on another planet. You would live inside one of these. It's an inflatable, so it can increase in size once this lands on the surface. So it's tight and compact when it's launched, but when it gets there, it can expand into more of a comfortable living quarter. And finally, our tour ended at the hangar to see NASA's latest research aircraft. Look at the size of this aircraft, a Boeing 777-777. Look at how big these engines are. There's two of these on this aircraft, and look at the wheels. It's almost chest high. This is one of the many things that you'll be able to see at NASA's Langley Research Center coming up this Saturday. Bring your families. We'll have all the details on wavy.com on where to park, how you can get here, what time it starts, again, on wavy.com. I'm Chief Meteorologist Jeff Edmonton. Back to you.